guys. Walgreens, 70% off holiday. And what do we got? Oh my God, an Emma Frost. Another Emma Frost. Um, yeah, I hit the jackpot of Emma Frost. Holy crap. And magic. And there's more. Yeah. More magic too. Okay, was not expecting that. Magic, more Emma. There is a X-Force Wolverine and just a ton of Emma Frost. Wow, okay. Was not expecting that, but that's cool. I know where to find one if I need one. Another one. All things. Uh, outside of that, first time seeing a My Hero Academia pop here. Scarlet Spider. All right, it's a no-go here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, and Johnny. All right, this place is kind of messy, but we're gonna look anyway. Oh, look at that. There's a Spider-Man here. Cool. Wolverine, Namor, Cannonball, and Wasp. So not what we're looking for. Nope. Okay. Well, we found this guy. But we're not going to pick him up. Not right now. So, uh. Uh, Alexa Bliss. Some more wrestlers back there. That's it. Okay. All right. It's a start. I wonder if that's part of the seventy percent. I mean, hell, why not? Might as well try and see what we find. All right. I haven't been to this one in a while. So, we are going to take a look. Wow, Han Solo, Kira, uh, nothing there. What do we got? What do we got? Medusa and a lot of magics. Yeah, it's a lot of magics. Yeah, so no go here. Vindicator, or Guardian, sorry. Wasp, Black Widow. So we are unlucky here. Yep. Black Ranger. There's a Kylos right over there. All right. No luck. And just out of curiosity, I'm going to have them scan these exclusives just to see if they come up. And then, well, that's poor condition. Really poor condition. That's not bad. Silk isn't bad. But, yeah, why not check? It might be 70% off. So, off all Jawas. That's all they got. They did do home plan again here. Kyrie right. Sane. That's awesome. Multiple hands. That looks good actually. That looks really good. And the new Triple H, which is the version I like. That's really cool. I got two. And yeah, that's cool. I'm missing, if they have this, yeah, that has the new Alistair Black on it. So that's not bad. Hey, there's the ring. That's regular price, though. <sighs> what else we got? And the aliens are here. So they're going to be All those. Hey, look at you. 
they got a ton. Wow. They got that Spider-Man, that Spider-Man, and they got the White Rabbit. I like this figure. This looks really cool. And there's the glider for Demo Goblin. So not bad. It looks really good. And look what we got here. We have the Superman. First time seeing you guys. And we have Green Lantern. Wow, that is huge. Seven inch figures. Seven inch figures. That's a big difference. And we have a Harley Quinn, which I was curious about this because the face is really like animated series like, but I guess they tried to mimic that comic book cover over there. But it's not bad. It looks pretty good. Collect them all. Ooh, there's a Birds of Prey. Oh, interesting. So, nice to see these out. So we have very nicely laid out that $25, $11 for Katana. That's regular price. Five bucks for those guys. That's regular price too, I think. That's regular price. Eleven dollars for those Fortnites. All right. Last fourteen days. What's up guys, how are you? Had another great week of some pickups and some mail calls. It's ridiculous. Um, this is turning out to be a crazy first month of 2020. January is kind of just stopped. They're just being stacked with a lot of stuff. And I am still shopping at the GameStop that's closing because there's little things, just like little things here and there that I was like, I can wait and see if it's, if it's still there, I'll pick it up because that GameStop is now at, what was it, 50 to 70% off. So picked up a little bit of things. Picked up what I wanted for the time being. I will go back because every Thursday they're kind of just marking down more and more. Uh, but I will go over what I got. It's a little crazy. It's, it's all random, honestly, it's all random. Um, but it's like, for example, I, I've never shown this before, but I picked up some Hot Wheels, because I there are like real life cars that I will probably pick up. And this, there's just, here's an example. So like this Camaro, uh, here is a 2005 Ford Mustang. And for all you Hot Wheels people that actually do collect this, I mean, you, you understand. 67 Shelby, like that. Um, this was for my son, this like armored looking Batmobile. And I was surprised to find this one. This one is cool, the Ford, the Ford GT right there. And my import cars, Honda Civic, look at that. Honda Civic, that's cool. And last one, which I love, I love collecting these specifically, Nissan Skylines, the red ones. I didn't find the silver one though, but I love Nissan Skylines. Uh, yeah, that's just random. I, I just, I, I'll, I'll always try to find a skyline and pick that up. Uh, but we'll go over this. So, GameStop. So, let me show you. Do I leave the receipt in here? Yeah, I did. Okay. So, I picked up four things. Uh, one was a fig pin. My Hero Academia, because I'm just addicted to this show now. It is $14.99 and I paid $5.10 because it was 70% off. So 70% off and that's awesome. So um, they had a little bit more fig pins left. I will pick up more if they still have any. It all depends. It's not like I, I'm really all into it like that. Uh, Destiny 2, I had Destiny 2. 
I got it when it first came out. Traded it in for the best value that it was, and then I only paid $1.50, because it was 50% off clearance items. So $1.50, I can, I never finished it, by the way, so I'll, I'll play it again. I still have my file. Uh, and last two, these, this is crazy clothing. <laughs> So I picked up this shirt. Many of you guys have seen this shirt before. The Saiyan Super Saiyan shirt. It was eight bucks, got it for $4, because it's 50% off of a clearance tag price. And uh, this, if you guys know what that symbol is, uh, this is a My Hero Academia hat. And this is like a fitted hat. This was $17 and these were 70% off, so this, came to uh, $5.10. Oh, messed up. This was $5.10. This was $4.50. Uh, so this is cool. This is a very simple hat. And a lot of people probably wear this around. Some people are not gonna get that, but that's cool. But it does have Go Beyond Plus Ultra. So, I mean, it's not like, yeah, it's a fitted hat. So um, there you go. And I, I bend my rims right there, so. Yeah, oh, let's keep that on. So there you go. Uh, receipt, as you will see, right there. 70%. So that is cool. That's really cool. Uh, also, went to when I was at Walgreens, because I am on that hunt for this flipping exclusive. And it sucks, because um, I haven't seen them on the East Coast yet, or anyone posting that it's on the East Coast. Uh, but there were some clearance items. And they were part of the holiday clearance, as you probably heard me say on the on the video. So I found two, and they were 70% off. So Funko Pops. So Funko Pops came to three dollars and twenty-nine cents, like that. So this one was Craven the Hunter. This was probably the best one in the best condition. It's not bad. But a Walgreens exclusive, Craven the Hunter. Uh, they, I was trying to find if they had Scarlet Spider or Spy, uh, Sandman. Um, I think they had Sandman, but I forgot. I don't remember. I was in a rush. I was on my way to work. And they had the Spider-Man Future Foundation. Uh, this I thought I got in a very good condition. And then, you don't see it, but there is a hole in the plastic. Yeah, so, oh well. Oh, I left the receipt right in there. So, this one was also the 329 price right there. Yeah, so, if you guys have your Walgreens still doing the holiday clearance, because they are clearing them out right now, see if you can find some of those Funko Pops. That's not a bad deal for Funko Pops, especially Walgreens exclusive ones. Um, Oh, let me show you this guy, because I forgot I wanted to show this to you guys. The Bucky Barnes Hot Toy. There we go. So this is his stand. Um, sorry. But there you go. Look at that. Look at this head sculpt. I am amazed with the detail and just the face alone. Awesome, and the gun. If you guys know what kind of gun this is, please let me know, because this gun, they it's got moving parts, springs, everything. The, the clip actually comes out. Um, this knife right here comes out. Um, so many little details here and there. The, the jacket opens up and there is a zipper right there. Arm, uh, it does come with his disintegrating arm uh, and multiple hands. But this gun is crazy. Like I can also I can maneuver this, take this off, scopes there. Um, yeah, that can open up. It's got pedestal piece right there. It's crazy. There's a spring right there. But awesome figure. Love hot toys for when I can pick them up. Um, but thank you to my wife for buying that for me for Christmas. Uh, we found. The Hulk, She-Hulk. So this is one more figure I picked up in regards to the Super Scroll Wave. And these were the, Doctor Doom and Hulk were the first two that I ever wanted. So 
Now it's just taking my time to pick up the rest of the Fantastic Four. Um, Thing would be my next choice. Uh, Nate Simmons, I know you're, you, you can try to help me out finding that one. Uh, but I haven't seen them in Walmarts, at least in my Walmarts yet. A lot of people have been seeing in their Walmarts. Um, I'm going to take my time. They all look great, honestly. They really do. Uh, but I will take my time with this wave. As well as, and this does look amazing. If you haven't picked up this Hulk yet, I would highly recommend it. Uh, and the other one that I'm definitely taking my time on, but I, I caved in and I bought it. I had to, because it looked great. It really did. I had to pick up the White Rabbit. This is really cool. Do you know how many things um, like you could do to change out like the jacket and make this like an Emma Frost figure? It's ridiculous. Uh, this, that artwork looks great. This figure looks great. And the, the Demo Goblin, Demo Goblin um, glider is in there. You know, I could probably put that with my, my, um, the Carnage Goblin. I forgot, I already forgot what the name. Um, I could probably do that one and have him on there. But this is the Demo Goblin. This is my first figure for this wave. Fortunately, I missed out on it twice so far from my last video and in this video. They had all of these guys, um, but the Superior Octopus, the Vulture, and Shang-Chi were not there. So they must have gotten two cases because for them to have four or three of each of these figures that were there is once again like missed it. Sucks. But this White Rabbit is honestly, I feel like it's a great pickup. This is a really cool looking figure. Um, it's it's different, you know? I mean, sometimes you just want something that will will stand out. And I, I think that's a great choice. So, um, what else? What else I get? Ah, some mail calls. So, got some, ordered something online, picked them up, uh, which is continuing My Hero Academia. I picked up the Amazing Heroes Volume 1. So this was the first figure in the line uh, of Izuku. Izuku, yeah. Izuku Midoriya. So that is what it looks like right there. Um, great looking sculpt right there. And here it is. Of course, I put it together because it does come in pieces. Here is Midoriya. Look at that. That is a great dynamic pose, especially. Um, I think it scales well with the rest of the Amazing Heroes line because um, he is a smaller character. Because here's Todoroki. Um, and then, kind of next to All Might, which All Might is definitely bigger in this particular line, the Amazing Heroes line, um, I think it scales pretty well. Yeah, I think it's, it's done very well. So, there is Midoriya. Loving these statues. They're awesome, very affordable. And one more, one more that I got. Was that really it? Yeah. One more that I got was a new Van Presto Grandista figure, which is part of the One Piece line. And this was actually, um, so I think it was supposed to come out in February, maybe March, I don't remember. Um, but um, found it online and was able to order it. And we have the Grandista Nami from One Piece, if you guys know that anime. This was great because I wanted, uh, there's a lot more Grandista line um, One Piece figures, um, not female ones. So this was the one that I wanted to pick up the most. Um, I am going to pick up more of this line um, from One Piece. But there you go. Uh, this is... Luffy from One Piece. It does have an interchangeable head, which is awesome. But this is the Luffy One Piece, and this is a giant figure. Um, it's about almost 12 inches because if you look at, yeah, if you look at the White Rabbit, I mean, that's how, that's the scale size. But next to Nami, I think it looks great. Here's Nami. Nami came in uh, two pieces, and next to Nami, actually work yeah looks good like it um, Nami figure looks great it did come with a stand on her feet which does not help I it's kind of weird to try and insert 
like her foot in there and I can't determine how because it's so like a wedge that you can't like you can't slide it or squeeze it in there because it's just gonna you know mess with the paint and I'm afraid to do it but she stands she stands very well so there she is loving these anime statues these are great provocative for this one particularly um, but this is an awesome sculpt for the One Piece figure. So there you have it. There that goes. They're going to look very well together. I'm going to probably order like the other two or three more characters that I saw online. Um, as long as I can find them at a good deal between $20 and $30, especially for the Grandista line, that is a steal. That is a great price for them. So that should be it. Thank God. Um, buying so much stuff this year. It's awesome. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching again. Um, really appreciate you following me on my journey to increase my collection and having fun, you know, hunting these things down, picking some stuff up. It's awesome trying to see all the cool new stuff that's coming out. But thank you guys again. Really appreciate it. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe as well. At the same time, leave a comment. Let me know what you guys have been finding. Let me know what clearance you've been finding because, you know, the clearance is running lower and lower now. Newer figures are coming out. Maybe you guys have been finding stuff that I haven't. So thanks so much for watching once again. Hope to see you soon. Hope to see you on the next hunt.